Welcome back. Are you hosting a holiday party this weekend? Are you a little stressed out about it? Well, we're here to ease those stresses. Please welcome Anna and Gary from Divine Events. Welcome, guys. Hi, Hello. Thank you. Happy to be here. Thank you. Yes, one of the most important things when it comes to a holiday party is the drink. The, cocktail. the cocktails. Yep. Yes, you want to have that first to get everyone at ease. And you have an easy to make cocktail here in front of us. What do we have? Yeah. So we took the old fashioned and we just mixed it up a little bit. So what we did is apple cider. You've got the bourbon. We chose Buffalo Trace, one of my favorites. So all we did is um, a little bit of bitters. You've got Buffalo Trace, apple cider. You cover it with ice. And then the fun part is going to be the garnish. I was going to say, yeah. Anna, the drink you're making, I might be able to make, but you make it look so fancy. What do we have to garnish it up? So different options. We've got little honey clusters. We actually have apple straws. They are real straws made out of apple. And then we have apple flowers. So you whenever drink, you're making you it. You can drink out of these? Yes. And where are we getting these ingredients? Um, so we got it from. Are they locally sourced? You can find them at the, any yes. grocery store here in town? Um, it's locally sourced, and I know. Hold on, one. we'll put it up. We'll, we'll find it. Okay. Because <laughs> I do. I do want to. If you want to find this stuff, you're going to find this stuff. I want to talk about because these are napkins here, but you make them look yes. so fancy. What's the we trick? Try. We try. So you do not have to be professional. I am definitely not with napkins. Um, so all we did was fold them. You can do it any type of way, and we're going to let you try in a little bit if you want to. And then you can take anything that's around your house. So we did a little bit of thyme and then rosemary. So these are things that you might have in your kitchen already. All right, show so me it's how great. it's done. So if you're watching at home and you want to yep. make this for your holiday party this weekend, you take your napkin. All right, so you are going to fold it any way you like. Okay. And then fold it in half. Simple folds. Yep. Okay. So then you're going to take this one is the rosemary. You're going to just lay it in and you'll bunch it up and then you take the coil. If you have twine, that can work as well. So then you just wrap it around. Right around yep. your napkin like this? Yeah. And this is what it's going to look like at JC's holiday party. <laughs> <laughs> but I see what you're saying. It's very simple to do. And yep. wrap it. Maybe and then real you tight. just keep going. I'm going to wrap it so tight Perfect. that so when my guests arrive, they won't be able to get the napkin out. Like, what is this? A gimmicky napkin? That's great. Now, That's we've got the drinks. We've got yes. the table looking good. We've got the food. Gary, what do we have in front of us? Here we have ahi poke tacos, tuna salad, seafood ceviche, and tr my attempt to try to make vegans happy, vegan tofu. It's a vegan Ta theme going yes. today. These are vegan tacos right here? Yes, vegan. 100% vegan. Also with a matching coconut crema with no uh, dairy in it. So, what about some of the tips that go into making the perfect taco bar? What do we need to have this? So, you this know is what? great. So, people can self serve when they come to your party. But, what are some of the items you should have, the standards? That's a good question. What you want to think about is taste, texture, color. Okay. And uh, uh, you want color contrast and flavor contrast. This looks so good. Taste, texture, color contrast. Color contrast. I imagine, imagine you go into a holiday party and you see this setup. It'd be the, the perfect holiday party uh, for anyone. This is great. Hi. Thank you guys so much. I really yeah. appreciate it. Um, and all this stuff, again, locally sourced, we can buy this anywhere to yes. make. Because where do you find these such, these little tiny, these little tiny cute little taco shells? Hey, we actually make those ourselves. You guys make them yourself? Yes, but they make taco uh, fryers. So you can get yes. these. Or you could always just come to Divine and visit us here. That's right. Yeah. And get your tiny Divine little events. taco shells right yes. there. Makes my hands look so big. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. Thank, Thank you. you. Appreciate it. Thank you.